I'll just sort of do a quick video of my little hydroponic setup here. Uh, me and the wife knocked up a shade house on a weekend and um, then went ahead and set up all my tubes on level stands. We've got a lower one there for the taller plants like the tomatoes. I've never seen plants grow this fast before. These are only five weeks, two days old since seedlings. Um, we have some capsicums here. And as you can see, oh, or well, can't see, they are uh, extremely large. <laughs> Another nice big one here. Five weeks, two days old since seedlings this high. Um, so the capsicums are doing extremely well in the hydroponics. Um, these are Lebanese cucumbers. I'll have to make a shelf up underneath for them to sit on. Uh, that was a scraggly old lettuce that we got from um, the hardware shop. It looked like it was nearly dead, but um, it's coming back. Decided to give corn a try. Just chucked the seed in the jiffy pot, plonked it in there. Um, they're two, two and a half weeks old. The corns. Strawberries are doing extremely well. This tomato plant here, yes it is a tomato plant, um, that is three weeks old, Some more strawberries there, I'm not too sure about these red cabbage, seem a bit scraggly, um, don't even know what that is, that come up alongside the um, seed seedlings, the, uh, that was inside the uh, seed pots with the um, strawberries there, a couple of more corns there. Now these lettuce here are doing extremely well, we've already had a couple, they're ready to go, ready to eat in five weeks, two days. Some seedlings, another corn. Uh, while we're up this end, I've just got a 140 litre tub, and the pump in there, we need some water. So this first line here, that's the return line from our low setup, and then the other two return lines are from our twin high pipes. So the water goes in back under here somewhere, splits off and goes in both directions to the left and the right, um, and then goes all the way up to the end, does the UE comes back along the inside pipe and same on the other side and then drains back into the tank. Uh, I have a couple of rock melons down there. It's me um, meter to show me the concentration of my nutrients in the water. These are beans. Like I said, everything's only five weeks, two days old from seedlings. We have got some beans coming. So we've got beans there. Peas. So they're starting to flower. And these are the tomato plants. These things are taller than me now, nearly touching the roof. So about six foot four. And um, I have been chewing them back. I need to get rid of some of these leafy branches that aren't going to do anything. But uh, we do have tomatoes in the making in there. All throughout. A bit hard to see because they're only small. Nice bunch in there. And then on this side here, our um, Chinese cabbage, and that's huge. Can't believe how fast that stuff grows. A um, couple of more corns. I thought I'd give corn a try. Another tomato plant. This corn's doing all right. It's a little bit yellow, but um, but yeah, you can see the size of these. That's the size of the leaves on them. And they've still got a ways to go. They're only just starting to bunch up in there now. But they are extremely large. So I have to remember that next next crop. But um a tomato plant there. But that is my setup. A uh, couple of weekends to build. A couple of um where are they? 
A couple of tomatoes come along there. But yes, only uh, five weeks, two days old. I can't believe how well those capsicums are grown. And also the um, Chinese cabbage is doing extremely well. And at the moment we're using about six litres of water a day. Now to grow this in soil, you would pump out that six litres in a minute with a sprinkler. So very efficient on water. Uh, no chemicals need to be used because we're in a shade house. Uh, no bugs and that can get in and we're off the ground as well. So no contaminants from the ground. Very happy with this. Okay, thanks for watching. Just something a little different. My first go at a really big hydroponic setup. Well, not really big, but big for us. There's only two of us, so uh, this is all we needed. And um, so far, it's going extremely well.